There's about five photo editing apps that I use on a regular basis, and one of these is called Lens Distortions. Now, I've talked about this app in the past, but it recently got an update, and I'm really excited about one of the new features. Now, Lens Distortions is an app that adds lighting effects to your photos. Now, in the past, these lighting effects were obviously just layered on top of the image, but the latest update has a feature where one of the lighting effects actually interacts with objects in your photo. So say you had a bunch of trees right here, you could put the light to where it looked like it was behind the trees and the light would be filtering through the branches on the trees. It's really cool. Let's take a look at it. I'm pulling it up here on my iPad Air. Now this program does work with Android or iOS and everything that I'm showing you here is on the free version. The paid version has extra lighting effects, but just all of the free lighting effects have been more than enough for me. So I'm going to select the photo that I want here and then just scroll over to where it says light volume. And now as I move this lighting effect around on the screen, you can see how it appears as though it's coming from behind the trees in the picture and the light is filtering through the branches. So I can move it over here and now this tree is in front of the light or I can move the light over here and that tree is staying in front of the light source. Very, very cool. And now you can see our before and after. The other cool thing you can do with this lighting effect is direct which way it's pointing. So let's take a look at another photo. I have this picture of a car and I'm going to make it look as though there's some light coming out of the headlights kind of off in this direction here. So I'm going to go to light volume. Now I can move it over to our headlight, shrink it down to the right size. And now if I go to settings, there's a ton of adjustments you can make in here. I'm just going to change the direction that it's pointing. Have it pointing off over here, kind of like that. And I can make it whatever color I want. I'm going to make it just a yellow color. And turn up the saturation. Now if I want to add in more lights, I can hit the plus sign right here. And I'm going to just add in a simple glow effect here just to finish out the headlight. Those little gaps in there. Fill those in and export it. And now you can see our before and after. I just think it's so cool that we have these incredible apps out there that we can use for free. And that's why I'm sharing these with you so you can go try them out too. Links in the description below. And this isn't a sponsored video. So if you'd like to help me out and help me keep creating content like this, then the best thing you can do is just hit that subscribe button and go watch some of my other videos right here. I'll see you guys next time. And I can change it, baby.